Top 5 Customer Facing Knowledge Based Systems for Your Business Hey guys, welcome back to the YouTube channel. Today we will be taking a look at the top 5 Customer Based Knowledge Management Systems for your business or for your team. So let's get into it. Now, what is a knowledge based system and what is the difference between a knowledge based system that is customer facing versus a normal knowledge based system? Now, if I was to talk about a normal knowledge based system, I would be talking about something like Confluence, which is a knowledge based system for uh, internal affairs. So let's say you're running a company and you need to keep some templates or some knowledge for all of your employees, then you would be using a program like that but for customer based knowledge management systems it is basically where you're going to be creating a knowledge base for your customers so your customers can get access to the information that they need so a platform like this where they're going to be able to access it through a landing page or via a link however you choose to set up your knowledge base and then they could click on any of the information you want this is especially useful for larger and more complicated businesses, if you are running a larger business and you have some normal and casual FAQs or you want your customers to be easily able to understand your business, then using a knowledge-based management system, which is customer-facing, is very important. So here are the top five that I have found and I will be comparing their pricing at the end of this video, so make sure you watch till the end. Now on number one, now these are in no particular order, but on number one, I have Document 360. Document 360 is the number one platform for customer-facing knowledge-based platforms. Document 360 has been a favorite of mine in terms of keeping documentation for both internal and external affairs. Now, the reason for that is whenever you create a new article on Document 360, you can go on ahead and choose the privacy of that article. So you can choose to make it a uh, internal article or external article just by clicking on add article. So this could be XYZ article, whatever it might be. So you can go on ahead and save this as a template or click on publish over here, enter any comments that you might want. So then again, now you can see we have this in the quality complaint section. You can also create more multiple different categories and you can also create multiple different segmentations to better manage all of your documents or all of the files and you also have a recycled bin as well as a separate drive where you can take a look at all of your storage documents you have images uh, you have pdfs presentation word documents and zipped files you have separate categories for all of these and all of your documents will be saved in these drive sections for you to get easy access or for your employees to get easy access then you also have analytics which is a super nice feature that will enable you to better view the performance of your article so you can see the total likes dislikes by your customers and the total reads of your customers as well and this will allow you to get a better understanding of what kind of information are customers looking for when they are looking at your business and this is actually a very useful tool that will enable you to customize your customers experience to what they are searching for now next up you also have content tools over here where you can do bulk operations as well as create a workflow so you have a workflow designer where you can create multiple different statuses you can add uh, let's say that you have a certain employee that is able to write articles but you always want to recheck their articles so you can add a review section for whatever article they write and until you approve that it wouldn't be published onto your actual portfolio and these are the features that are going to be super helpful as well as the import and export features where you can import and export it into any form and you can also export your contents into a pdf and then save your pdf on your devices on your mobile phones or even on your desktop computers for more access now going on ahead on number two we have pro prof so pro profs is a tool that is especially useful for teachers because they are able to create quizzes they are able to make surveys and if you are a research student or a teacher then pro profs is something you might have already used now pro profs is a knowledge-based management system that is also customer oriented so you can go on ahead and create a simple customer oriented platform you can go on ahead and also create user manuals and also document your softwares with their platform and this is going to be especially helpful for people that are looking to create a more teaching 
format for their customers so if you're looking to teach someone something if you're looking to create a support center for your business then this is definitely a good option they are able to create not only corporate wikis but also use your manuals and internal knowledge based systems as document 360 can so your employees can also get a exclusive access to exclusive knowledge and then you can provide certain knowledge for your customers as well now they also provide you with multiple different templates like these to choose from whenever you are going to create your knowledge base and you can customize it and make sure that it is cohesive to your overall brand image as well now you can go ahead and sign up for free over here on the top right and register to create your account on pro profs now moving on to number three we have zendesk so Zendesk is another CRM platform. So they also offer you the option to create a knowledge-based system. So this will enable you to create a knowledge-based system, but they are primarily a CRM, but they do allow you to go ahead and create knowledge bases for both customers, so customer-oriented knowledge bases, as well as employee-oriented knowledge bases. So they are also a good option for people that are just starting out. And if you're already using this for your sales or marketplace or their sunshine platform then simply opting for zendesk might be the simpler or more easier option for you now moving on to number three we have stillney.com so stillney.com is very specified in terms of making a customer oriented knowledge base you are going to be able to provide a adoptive solution for your current customers you can create a self-service report a support agent performance as well as well as team knowledge and learning and you can also get started for free on their platform and they have multiple use cases as well as podcasts and templates as well so you can create multiple choice guides checklists release notes Notes, contact forms troubleshooting guides for your customers as well as basic things like faqs and user manuals and you also have specific use cases so you can create this for a customer knowledge base you can also have a chatbot alternative you can also have onboarding and product tours for your business as well now moving on to the next platform we have help juice so help juice is a super super effective knowledge based software they also provide you with all of the features that we previously discussed as well as the google like search so this brings in a aspect of familiarity for your customers and it is extremely customizable as well as it provides you optimizing seo features so you can optimize this for the search engine as well and you also have multi-language support and multiple different templates that you can choose that will enable you to create your knowledge based system in a more brand cohesive manner now these are just some of the topics that I have for customer management platforms. Now, in terms of pricing, we have Document 360, which has a free version. We also have Zendesk, which does not have a free version. Then you have plans like Stony, where you do not have a free version. You have other platforms like Help Juice as well, which does not have a free version. However, you do get a 14-day free trial, and then you have pro profs which does enable you to create public quizzes and get advertisements on those public quizzes on the pro profs quiz maker so you don't get any reports or any other complicated features or you can't actually build your customer facing knowledge base on the free version of pro prof so if you are looking to build a absolute free customer facing knowledge base document 360 is your only option however if you are looking to pay for different features and more exclusive or powerful plans then you can opt for any one of these in terms of scalability and pricing if you're looking for the lowest paid version then zendesk has the sweet team version starting at 49 dollars and if you take a look at help juice they start at 120 dollars document 360 starts at 99 dollars as well as stillney so depending on the amount that you are choosing to invest you can go on ahead and choose the best platform for your business with the specific features that you might need so that was it for today i hope you guys found this video helpful make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the youtube channel and if you have any questions or queries leave them in the comment box down below and i will catch you guys in the next video